What is up everybody? Welcome back to another video here on Loud and Proud. I'm actually in the first gen in the passenger seat. My mom is going to be driving the first gen. Is this the first time you've ever driven this? Yes, I'm a little bit nervous. She's never driven the first gen before. You want to make sure it's okay, in drive. Is it in drive or? We'll let off the brake slowly and it'll start rolling if it's okay, in drive. Yep. Oh yeah. I haven't got to drive this yet. Any first reactions? I'm insured, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Listen to that truck though, man. This is the first, and not only is this her first time driving, this is the first drive in this truck on dry roads. Look, how, what, how warm is it, 70 out today? 70, I think, 70, it's 70, 71. It's the first drive of the year on dry roads, no snow, no slush, no salt. Do you know what, you wanna know what this reminds me of? My dad let me drive, first time I ever drove in a big field, it was a Dodge first gen, but it was like a toothpaste green color, like teal. It was the old first gens, like the original first gen. First anyway, gen. I just remember him being in the field, the door open, we had these same kind of little things on the mirror here, and I hit the brakes really hard, and he, he was standing on the edge of the door open, he slung forward, and it kind of injured him a little bit. Sorry, sorry dad, you're watching. Listen to that. We get the AC vents right here. Oh, Old yeah. school AC. I don't know if you guys are seeing this video and you haven't seen some of the other ones, but for some reason YouTube isn't pushing notifications for a handful of channels. Mine, I don't know how many of you guys know who Buck BMX is for his channel. He posted a video or two recently and like a full 24 hour period's gone by and generally for both of our channels, we both average one to 2,000 views per hour for the first 10 to 20 hours of the videos being up. Right now we're averaging like a couple hundred an hour and that's leaving us with almost no views and I think it's because notifications aren't being pushed for a lot of channels, just a lot of smaller channels. Yes, I consider myself a smaller channel. Notifications aren't getting pushed and so people aren't seeing the content so it just makes it a real pain in the butt because you might have some cool new things coming on and new products to install like I did the other day but people aren't getting to see the videos because the uh, notifications are getting pushed and I've had people say that even people who have notifications turned on manually, which means that they're supposed to send no matter what, not just for suggested content, they're not even getting notifications. But I've had a couple people say that they're still getting them, but I've had a ton, just tons of messages of people asking like, why aren't you posting videos anymore? I said, no, I've been posting them. Notifications just haven't been going out. So we'll get that situated. Well, I don't know what, I can't really do anything about it, but hopefully that gets situated soon so everybody can see the videos so because- just check. Yeah. Just check. Yeah. Just check since I do post daily content. Just just make it a habit just to check, you know, once a day. Just get on in the afternoon. Usually after 8 o'clock is a safe time to check and just see if the video's up. Because um, I don't know what the deal is, but it's uh, it's not cool when people aren't seeing what's, you know, the latest and greatest stuff has happened. Like your mom being on the YouTube, driving a truck. Here's an old OBS F350. Oh, yeah, I think we said this. This is the one year anniversary. It was around. And this is the first time I'm driving it. This is the first, <laughs> this, almost this exact hour last year to this date, we were loading up in the King Ranch with a gooseneck, going to pick up this truck. We hadn't even looked at the truck this time last year. So. This is a day to remember, okay? And then I think it, tomorrow would be the first day I ever posted a video on Loud and Proud. And it was actually picking up this truck. This was the first video that went on the channel. And it, I really set the bar high with that first video. That first video was actually like really, really good. If you guys haven't seen it, I'm gonna go drop a link in the description so you guys can check it out. It was the first video I ever posted on this channel. And it was actually picking up this first one. So it's a really cool video. And I thought I did really good for my first video on this channel. What do you feel so far driving this truck? Good. There's some play in the steering. I'm yeah. Not it's used to, it's not like the Impala. It's not like sure. the Impala. Not like the Impala. It's, a, I don't know. It's, it's just, good. it drives like a tank a little bit. Like it's just good. big, broad. It is. I'm not used to that. I kind of like. Like look at the, look at the view over the hood. It's just like, it's just this massive boxy Next truck going line. down the road. Long way, boys. Long way. 
Hey, this is Mama Loud and Proud. I'm hijacking Malachi's camera. He's putting diesel in this truck. Anyway, I'm gonna take him to get ice cream later because this is his one year anniversary. He's done awesome. Thank you guys for supporting him. Appreciate it. Gotta go. I thought I lost the keys. I had them. <laughs> Sounds good. Does that ever get old? No. Not much starts like a first year. The Impala's kind of not quite as impressive. I like the Impala. It just doesn't sound like this. So, Malachi. Yes. I'm gonna take you to get a Boston cooler. Aren't you happy about that? Yeah. Yeah. Who doesn't like a little ice cream, you know? Not just any ice cream though, a Boston cooler. What is a Boston cooler, you ask? A vanilla milkshake made with Verner's, so it's amazing. It's kind of like a root beer float, but not root beer. Yeah, that makes sense. Root beer float, but better. Root beer float, which is not root beer. It's like uh, ginger ale, isn't it? We are off to the post office to mail out what? The winner! For the woo, woo. I have another giveaway coming up in a few days, and this one's gonna be even more narrow it down to where this giveaway was only a maximum of 80 people. The next one I'm gonna do is gonna be, you have to buy keychains to enter again, but there's only gonna be 18 entries allowed. So that really increases the odds compared to 80. And then 80 was already better than previously, which was just as many people as they wanted to enter, just enter. I'm trying to make these a little more interesting each time. So I think this is gonna be a good one. Next stop. Ice cream. You good? My yeah, treat, good. my treat. I'm good, yeah. It's about time. Whatever. There you go. You get to see a train. I think they're so cool. But just a minute ago, you would have got to hear it too. Instead, you get to hear the first gen. Yeah. yeah. Hey, I'll take the first gen. I'm cool with the first gen. The train sounded pretty cool. This is basically is a train while I'm going down the room. Loud black smoke. Kinda, kinda like a train. I get a little too excited about the simple things. Notice how I'm not driving the first gen right now. Yeah. I was what happened? I don't know what happened. I was starting to feel uncomfortable. I was doing a good job. I didn't hit anything. Hey, we're at the ice cream place. You make such a scene <laughs> everywhere we go. He thinks I make a scene everywhere we go. You do. It's totally not true, don't believe him on that. And listen, if you can't get a Boston cooler in your neck of the woods, you can try making one. Really good vanilla ice cream. And Verner's. You know, more vlogging than me today. They're taking forever. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. Yeah, who's that? This thing is amazing. Like, I would totally share this. Ah! Falling. <laughs> that was like skirt, skirt. There are no makeup mirrors in the first gen, so that could be a drawback, right? Not for me. No makeup mirrors, no makeup stains. Cheers to another amazing year on Loud and Proud. Everybody, that's the end of our little joy ride in the first gen today. Again, one of my favorite trucks. It's got to be the first gen Nasty Red and the Dually are probably my top, my top picks. Um, just hard to beat a classic 12 valve. Just sound, feel, drive. It's just hard to beat. I still have not taken the big stinky in a, for a rip yet with a new pusher intake horn on it. Um, I just haven't done so yet because I have. Now I had a chance to run out of the barn yet. Basically when I finished up the job last time, a couple minutes later I had to leave and my grandparents were here and so we were hanging out and stuff. I'd like to do an exhaust on it as well. Probably sooner than later. This truck has right now the stock exhaust all the way back until I want to say the rear wheel. And then it was basically cut off there and then uh, they welded a five inch 
for the rest of it. They just kind of exits right there on the side. The wheels and tires, guys, I get so many questions. Where are your wheels and tires? Where are your wheels and tires? Again, the tires, I don't know how many of you guys saw this, but over on the channel, Team LNP, I made a video kind of going through me actually calling the place back and being like, where are my flipping tires? You know, it's like, like I, when they were a week late, I was like, okay. Sometimes things, people just get behind. It's understandable. Two weeks, okay, I'm a little bit frustrated, so I'll just call them and just see, have I shipped yet? You know, just so I can have a peace of mind about it. A month, I was like, okay, this is just, this is just crazy. Like a month um, past schedule, like that's just, yeah, unheard of. So anyways, I call them up and they're like, oh yeah, don't even have those Patriot tires. Those have been gone for a long time. And I was like, okay, well then what can I get? You know, so ordered a different set, which wasn't quite what I wanted, but you know, they did the best that they could, I guess, on that regard on getting the price down on that set. So basically almost for the exact same price, I got a different set that was supposed to be a lot more expensive, but um, they were able to get the price down for me to match that since it was kind of inconvenient to say the least. Those are on the way. Okay, that was about a week ago. I reordered a different set. So those are on the way. And the wheels are going to be these fuels. The fuel Mavericks, 20 by 12 Fuel Mavericks. Those are gonna go on that truck. Just so it's all clear, Fuel Mavericks and 33 by 1250s. So basically it's gonna be like this setup. The only difference is it's not gonna have the killer Anthem Gunners on there. It'll look good. I'm gonna film a video for Team LNP. I'm not gonna talk about anything right now in terms of what I'm feeling. Got some stuff on my chest I wanna share with you guys, but I'm gonna leave that for that channel because we don't do that here. Just to recap a couple of things. One full year on the channel is tomorrow. Tomorrow was the first day. One year ago, tomorrow, I posted a video on this channel. And I started out with, of course, zero subscribers, zero help, no shout outs, no promotions, no, you know, people with hundreds of thousands of subscribers giving me mentions and stuff like that, like, like nothing. I started from scratch with a GoPro that had kind of crappy audio and fuzzy video. And I started from there and the channel's at just about 60,000 subscribers in one year of solely dedication, to be quite honest with you, dedication and posting every single day. Almost, except for I think I missed 30 days total throughout the entire year, which isn't too bad. I think I've got about 330 uploads, give or take, in a year. So that's that's not too bad. One full year, first ride in the first gen since we stored it away. First actual drive, we pulled it out of the barn and back to back in, but I'm saying first drive in a long, long time. And that was my mom's first time driving the first gen. In about five or six hours, it'll be actually the exact moment last year that we brought this truck home and unloaded it in the barn in the dark. So like I said, I'm gonna try to leave a link to that video, the very first video, not only was the first video, the first video, and the video of getting that first gen in the description below. It's super good video. It was my first video ever on this channel and it was definitely one to remember. It was the first of many to come and it's been, it's been, uh, it's been a real good time. So I'm super excited for everything and where things are gonna go. So hopefully soon here, we can get some crazy stuff happening here. Hopefully you guys are doing great. Definitely don't forget to check out the last couple days worth of videos, content um, was good and notifications were not going so good. So a lot of people didn't see the video. So hopefully you guys definitely go and check out those videos. They were really, it was really good stuff. Just notifications, YouTube's kind of not pushing notifications even for people that haven't turned on. A lot of people aren't getting them. So it's kind of pain in the butt. So if you guys could go watch those, that would be awesome. Really helps out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully enjoy the video. If you did smash the thumbs up, leave your comments down below. Subscribe if you're new. Join the team, join the family. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.